What's up? So I moved from Kensal Green yesterday um, to my mother's friend's house, which is this house, and it's amazing. Both my aunt and uncle are really, really, really nice to me. Um, they introduced me to Norevang yesterday, and we had some dinner, and it was all super great. Today um, they went to a church seminar, so I'm home by myself, so I thought that might be the right opportunity to show you the house without looking like a weirdo. So the coolness already starts at the door. Apparently you have to press... Very like that. So then you have the code on the other side that you have to put in rather than the key. And then it does that again, which is really creepy. So this is the entrance. Um, as most Koreans are, they're Christian, so you have a lot of these on the wall. So this is Uncle Study. Um, he's a writer, so you can clearly see that from the big collection of books that he has. A very cool globe. So then we go into the kitchen. Um, my aunt felt really embarrassed about that, and I thought this looks amazing. It's like this great mix between old and new and Korean stuff and Western stuff and I just love the layout of the house to be honest. So then you go to the living room. Look at how pretty that garden is. That is just gorgeous. My computer and look at this. Look how pretty this is. Like a huge amount of food that it left behind for me. When I was, that's a quite big TV. Okay, this guitar honestly was so out of tune. Like I, normally you don't really have to turn these that much because, you know, because of slight temperature changes or, you know, something like that, it could change a little bit. But honestly, I had to crank these up a lot. Can you imagine the awesomeness that this house contains? So then we go up. Alright. So here it says, Yesu Nim. I know that Nim basically is something, it's like a suffix that you place after a name to give like extra respect so now i'm wondering is yesu how they say jesus over over there in korea this is the bathroom i already took a shower today and honestly i love like the old school telephone feel the shower has and what i love about staying with other people is that i get to use all their bath products which sounds pretty weird. I used that one. I wasn't even sure if it was shampoo, but it said Mori on the flask. And Mori means head. Uh, so I assumed it was used for that. So this is the room where I'm staying in. So this crap, the luggage, uh, is mine. But just look at the rest of the room, which is just amazing. I have like a little couch to sit on. That's definitely a a luxury I didn't have before. I love this picture because there's so much going on. Like here, there's someone calling on the aid of Gondor, and then there's this person soulfully playing a violin for this tiny child. 
And then for some reason, someone used HM5 for fly on this person. And just look at the view that I have outside. I mean, very nice. This is on an uncle's bedroom and the personal wardrobe, so I'm not going in there. I actually never went up here. Mm. I want this many books. Hi. I feel I feel right at home. I feel right at home. Damn. Alright, so that was the tour. So I'm going to turn on my laptop, which is like an inevitable part of my daily life. And um, also going to eat some late breakfast, which also seems to be quite inevitable if you want to survive.